Okay, Pisces. This is going to be for Pisces singles in love for the 17th through the 24th of November. Okay, Pisces singles. What do we have going on for Pisces singles as far as options in love for the 17th of November through the 24th? Pisces. What's going on with Pisces? Pisces. 17th to 24th. Pisces singles. Options. One more shuffle, guys. All right. Oh, I think you attracted someone. Someone's very attracted to you. Fire sign. Aries. It looks like hmm. Pisces, either either you have several suitors here, or this is an Aries that is very male in particular very intrigued by you um but they're not actually stepping forward physically and then you have an earth sign that is coming your way energetically is what i mean um, but they're moving very, very slow. That's Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And they are not really like they, they, they think about it like they're really focused on it. Like they're really trying to figure out how to come towards you. If it's a good idea to come towards you. Because I feel like it's something that they're looking at that happened in the past. And I feel like what they're looking at, this earth sign, what they're looking at is, has anything changed with you? So this, this looks like, this earth sign looks like an X, okay? Trying to figure out if something has changed with you. Because the way they view you is somebody that is like in love with love. Somebody that's not really grounded in the way that they show emotions. Like, you know, once, once you get hooked on someone it's like you love and you love and you love and you pour all this love into somebody even if they are really not that deserving of it and then when you get upset like you really really get upset and they are having a hard time trying to figure out you know do you have that balance right now is what i feel and that's what's like hindering them that's what's like you know causing this pause this air this aries this fire energy i feel like this is a new person this is a new person that is intrigued by you i feel like they look at you as somebody that um is very confident that does not mind speaking their peace that is very forthcoming. They see you as very stable and smart, articulate. And they are an emperor. And I don't see them as like this stubborn person. I see them as somebody that has like control of their life. Like 
a really good, solid person. Then you also, at the same time, you know, this could be an air sign as well that you were wanting to offer something to. Here. Like you have offers coming in or you have options rather that are present um, that are really looking at you as like a potential mate. This fire sign here is very intrigued by you. This earth sign here, somebody that you've had something with. And this earth sign may also, you know, this, this king of swords may be the same person as the knight of pentacles in the way that they move, okay? In the way that they move. But let me pull these other two cards so I can get Yeah, so the Knight of Pentacles The Knight of Pentacles feels like they left you and you're feeling like, you know, that they deserted you basically in the relationship that you had previously. And they're wondering if, you know, you're still like overreacting or, you know, still very emotional about this thing. Have you found like that, that um, stable grounding for them to be able to come in and approach you? Because I feel like, I feel like they want to come in and approach you. But this fire sign is wanting to is wanting to come in and and talk to you. They want to come in and start something with you. And I feel that very strongly right here. Very strongly right here. Because the fire sign looks at you like you're very grounded, very stable, able to verbalize what it is that you need to, you know, put out there. Like you are very articulate. You say what you mean and you mean what you say. That's how this fire sign views you. So I feel like this is a new person that you have possibly like engaged with on some level. And then the earth sign is somebody that is already, um, that you've already had, you know, previous communication, contact with, um, as far as being in a relationship, I feel like, okay? So again, we have Aries here. Um, it could be any other fire sign, but I, I feel strongly Aries. And then we have um, Taurus. Let's see. And um, strongly Taurus. Then we have air. I mean, we have all the all the elements here. The signs really don't matter, but you you guys know your own separate situations here. But that's just the energy that's present. Okay, somebody's very like focused on you here got that sex appeal going on Pisces that real sex appeal all right guys so that is your um, those are your love options for the week of the 17th through the 24th and I'll be speaking with you